Hey everybody. Um, I'm just doing a video real quick. It's going to be a short one. And uh, I'm starting another journey. I know that I've done other videos like this before. I hate looking at myself with these glasses on and no makeup. Sorry, but I rarely wear makeup. Anyway, I got up this morning and I weighed 168 pounds and from around my belly button is 44 inches. And I've got this recipe here for this cabbage soup. I'm sure you've heard of it. They use it in hospitals to help people lose weight that are getting ready for surgery that might be overweight. You should be able to lose 15 to 17 pounds in seven days doing this diet. Anyways, let me turn it around over here. Well, it's not going to be able to do it. I'm going to show you I'm cooking it right now. Nope. Can you see that? And I'm going to tell you what's in it real quick. Okay, you need 16 ounces of canned diced tomatoes, one large green onion chopped in bite-sized bits. And what I did is I didn't have any green onion, and I didn't know that was on there, so I just used a regular white onion chopped up. One uh, envelope of Lipton onion soup mix, one bunch of celery, a head of cabbage, a large head of cabbage. Um, I did say a bunch of celery, right? And one can, two cans of uh, eight ounce green beans. Don't sound very good, but that's what it calls for. And then two green peppers, but uh, bell peppers, but it doesn't really matter. I mean, like I put in a, a red one and a green one just for some color. And uh, it's, it calls for three pounds of carrots, but I decided not to put quite that much in. And let's see, it never said how much water. So I put like four cups of water. And also you're supposed to use bouillon cubes. And I put bouillon cubes and you could salt and pepper it to taste or use cayenne pepper. I didn't want a bunch of salt, so I barely used any salt. I used the pink salt, the Himalayan salt. So anyways, I'll be back. And let you know if it works you have to eat today i'm gonna today's day one and i can eat all the soup i want and i'm supposed to eat fruit and on day two let me read this to you real quick so today i had an apple i had a, a tangerine i believe and a couple of strawberries let's see i want to share this with you in case it works you might want to do it well if i can just it's hard to operate a camera and turn paperwork. Okay, day one. Today, like I said, only eat soup and fruit today. Tomorrow, all vegetables. Eat all the raw vegetables and canned vegetables except beans, peas, and corn. And you, of course, you can eat all the soup you want. And at dinner, you can have a baked potato with butter. As long as you're eating your soup. Day three. Eat all the soup, fruits, and vegetables that you want. No potatoes or bananas. Now, day four, eat, whoa, eat three bananas, drink three glasses of skim milk, and drink as much glasses of water as you like. Eat lots of soup as well. Day five, eat the soup at least once this day, at least once. You may have uh, 10 to 20 ounces of beef. That's pretty good. And a can of, what? And a can of tomatoes, or as many as six fresh tomatoes. Try to drink at least six to eight glasses of water to wash out away uretic, uretic, uretic acid, uric acid from your body. Day six beef and vegetables eat all the beef and wow that's nice eat all the beef and vegetables where did i go that you want no potatoes eat the soup at least once the once that day day seven brown rice unsweetened fruit juice vegetables again stuff yourself be sure to have um have the soup at least once that day by the time you're done on the seventh day, you should uh, have lost anywhere from 10 
to 17 pounds. I thought it was 15 to 17. Anyways, this is going to be a jump start for me to start back on keto. I just figured if I can knock off that weight and then after this diet, switch back to keto. Because keto is pretty easy, really. Anyways, love y'all. Have a blessed day. Happy dieting if you're going to start. And if you haven't uh, subscribed, please do. Give me a thumbs up if you liked the video. Anyways, have a blessed one. And I'll get back to you soon.